What's good, YT? I'm coming to share with you a collective haul. Um, Dollar Tree, TJ Maxx, a local grocery store, and Bed Bath & Beyond. Okay, I got these from the Dollar Tree. I was sitting at the bus stop hungry. I hadn't eaten anything all day. And I opened one of these. I really enjoyed them. And I guess my daughter did too because when she came in a little while ago, she took two out of here. And it's two different flavors in the package. <clears throat> Excuse me, it's rosemary and olive oil. And you've seen the other one, the Tuscan cheese. Again, that was from the Dollar Tree. I had grabbed this bottle of Dashani water from the Dollar Tree to drink at the bus stop. But when I got outside, I was cold and I never drunk, drunk it. Um, this is a repurchase for me. The um, Badaya Natural Herb Tea. Mm, I like it because it keeps you regulated, if you know what I mean. And it's 10 bags in here. The only thing I do is heat it up with um, boiling water and put honey in it or some peppermint. I got these from the Dollar Tree. Put in my candy dish. And then assorted shoes by Mother's Finest. The Dollar Tree. I got this from TJ Maxx. I mean, TJ Maxx from Marshalls, and it was on clearance for $9. It was originally $11. I had stuff sitting on top of it, but basically you store your eggs in. Or me, when I make double eggs, I'm going to use it for that. Steak smoked turkey breast. I really, really like this. And they're ultra thin, which is a must for me if I can find it. This is a repurchase for me from Dollar Tree. The Uts chips, I got these probably like two months ago. And I haven't been to the Dollar Tree in probably like a couple weeks. So, yeah, anyways. I was glad to see that they had them back, and y'all can see the original price, and I did purchase these out the grocery store before, but they was a different flavor. I got this Golden Blossom Honey, um, 40 ounce, from the grocery store, Stop and Shop, and it was $14.99 if I'm not mistaken. And I had a 75% off, a 75 cent off coupon, which it doubled. So this will last me probably about maybe three or four months. I got some low sugar Quaker oatmeal. Um two flavors, peaches and cream. I will not be utilizing that peaches, I mean the strawberry and cream. Uh, I'm not a strawberry fan like that. <coughs> Excuse me, you guys. Um, this is from Bed Bath & Beyond. It is Carrot Brew K-Cups. Assortment of it. Um, we got the original Donut House on the top row. And Wicked Winter Blend Limited Edition by Green Mountain. Um, the original Donut Shop Decaf. And the Donut Shop Coffee 
Gloria Jeans, Hazelnut, Donut Shop again, Donut Shop Decaf, Donut Shop Decaf. Um, yeah, this was originally, was it $20? I just saw it on clearance, and I was like, let me just get it. So when I got to the register, I'm like, if it don't ring up to a price that I'm content with, then I'll just tell them I don't want it. When they said $3.99, I was like, I'll take it. Um, hopefully I can get back within the next couple of days to the store and grab a couple more if they still um, have them. And I'm almost done, you guys. And the last thing I got was this from Bed Bath & Beyond. It is a three-tier adjustable oven rack. Um, I don't know why they say adjustable because when you open it, you just give you these three layers. There's no adjusting it, you know, to two layers. Open it, you set it up, and this is the how it's proportioned to that height, three levels. Um, and it was originally $16.99. I had a 20% coupon off. And it was on sale for $12.99. So I got a good lick on this. And it's very good um, stainless steel. It's not flimsy and it's not cheap. So you can utilize it. This is how it comes when you take it out the box and then you open it up, set it up. It was honestly, I don't know if I'm slow, but it was complicated to, for me to put together. It looks easy, but it wasn't as easy as it portrayed to look on the box. Unless I'm just slow, like I said. But anyways, it's a great addition to use in your household if you are cooking a large meal for Thanksgiving, Christmas, and you need ample additional space in your oven. You know what I'm saying? And you can also utilize it to bake. When you bake your cakes, put the cakes on the top row. And then on the second, the first and second row, you can put your pies to cool off. And I have a miniature oven, a special needs oven, and it fits in my oven. All right, you guys, I held you long enough. I hope um, everyone have a beautiful day today. I don't know when I'm going to get this video upload. Today is um, February 3rd. Um, shout out to all the ladies and the gentlemen who have birthdays this month. All right, y'all, y'all already know what it is. As always, keep it sexy. Toodles, y'all.